the story of kalpana chawla a role model for the countless indian women kalpana chawla was an ordinary girl from karnal whose specific dreams and benchmarked courage took her to space kalpana chawla was born on march 17 1962 Kalpana Chawla grew up in an environment where she got an opportunity to understand the value of time and education. The youngest of four siblings, Kalpana was a most eminent child. Her natural curiosity, creativity, capability and delight in discovering new things worked were encouraged by her mother. Kalpana was a highly creative and imaginative child. Another thing that caught young Kalpana's fancy were airplanes. Back then, Karnal was one of the few Indian towns with a flying club called Karnal Aviation Club. As her house was just a few kilometers away from the club, she would often go up to the roof and watch them go roaring over her head. During her schooling at Tagore Bal Niketan, Karnal, Kalpana would draw colorful pictures of scientists on airplanes flying in the sky. She also loved making airplane models in her craft classes. Hard-working and focused Kalpana was a good student who enjoyed her favorite subject science. Other than dancing, she also enjoyed cycling, running and playing shuttle. Kalpana Chawla kept her straight hair, never put up any makeup and rarely paid attention to the fashion. After her class 10 board examinations, Kalpana got admission in DAV college for her higher studies. After this, Kalpana left for Chandigarh where she took admission in Punjab Engineering College. During counseling for the selection of various engineering courses, she chose aeronautical engineering the only girl to do so in college kalpana put her heart and soul into her studies as there was no girls hostel she lived alone in a tiny room over a garage cycling to college every day in her free time she devoted herself to learn karate the martial art and earned a black belt she enjoyed listening to classical rock Kalpana also loved collecting magazines and books on aviation and would read them from cover to cover. She became a student editor at her college magazine and the joint secretary for the college's aero club and astro society. Always enthusiastic about working on new projects. She surprised her professors and seniors by presenting a paper on time lapse in space. The same year she began working at NASA's AMS Research Center. Despite her busy schedule, she kept in touch with her school and college in India. Thanks to her efforts, every year two students from Tagore Bal Niketan were given the opportunity to visit NASA. In December 1994, Kalpana Chawla reported to the Johnson Space Center. In March 1995, as an astronaut candidate in the 15th group of astronauts in november 1996 she was assigned as a mission specialist and prime robotic arm operator on space shuttle sts 87 as part of her first mission kalpana traveled 6.5 million miles in 252 orbits of the earth and logged 376 hours and 34 minutes in space becoming the first indian origin woman to go to space less than 5 years later she has cleared by nasa to fly abroad colombia for a second time kalpana chawla received many honors and accolades that includes congressional space medal of honor nasa's best flight engineer and many more The crew of STS-107 in October 2001. Kalpana Chawla left the Earth on February 1, 2003. Kalpana Chawla died in the space shuttle Columbia disaster. Along with the other six crew members, 
When the Columbia disintegrated over the Texas during re-entry into the Earth's atmosphere, with the two missions in space, Kalpa Chawla had logged a total of 30 days, 14 hours, and 54 minutes in space. Chawla's remains were identified along with those of the rest of the crew members and were cremated and scattered at Zion National Park in accordance with her wishes. In her last email to the students of Punjab Engineering College, Kalpa Chawla wrote, The path from the dreams to success doesn't exist. May you have the vision to find it, the courage to get onto it, and the perseverance to follow it. This is the story of Kalpana Chawla. If you like this, please share and subscribe. Thank you.